Hey YouTube, we're back with semi-final part two. We have 14 imps up with 16 boards to play against Vassen. Vassen's played these this time, so we're going to get results at the end of the stream. And we're going to see whether I can make the final of the uh, single elimination part of it. And then once I'm eliminated from that, I will drop into the bottom bracket and try and make the final that way. So hopefully I can win and not have to um, win more matches to get back to where I am. But we're going to just jump in straight away. 16 boards of best on bridge it is a straight knockout, effectively. Um, with the option of playing some more matches once you've lost. Um, and we are 14 imps up after a moderately flat first set. Two big slam swings and then just a few imps here and there. So we're going to uh, be dealt with a weak no trump to start with. We're going to open one club. We might even pass for partner responds here. Um, if partner responds, we'll see. Uh, what's 1N? So I've got a choice between 1 Spade and 1N. I think 1 Spade is probably unbalanced in theory. 1N is just a weak no chump with a heart stop. So I think that's what I'm going to do. I don't really like it because my heart stop's not very good. I realistically only have one heart stop. Um, but I've got the King of Diamonds and this hidden Spade suit. So I think 1N, you can have up to 4 Spades. So I'm going to bid 1N. And help partner passes, yeah. Right, so this is bad because we're going to get a heart lead. They're going to lead the best suit for the defense here, which um, is likely to be East's five card suit here. Um, but bear in mind, East initially is a passed hand, so East can't have too much. Uh, that lead has given us a second heart stop. My seven of hearts is going to come into play now. It goes 10, Jack, King, and then they've got the ace and the queen to take out the eight and a small heart from my hand, and my seven of hearts is going to come good. Um... So I think what I'm going to do is win this and play in clubs. Uh, clubs is a suit I'm going to lose two tricks in. So I'm hoping to lose two hearts, two clubs, and then maybe something else. But if I can find how the clubs split, for example, if East has both club honours, they can't. But if East has the ace of clubs, I know the king of spades is offside. So I won't bother running the jack of spades. I might try and pick up the queen of diamonds instead. So we will cover this. All right, and they play the queen back. Okay, so the switch of spades, I'm certain the king of spades is wrong. That means the club honours might be split. And if the club honours are split, it probably means that queen of diamonds is on side. My guess is that for east to switch to spades here, um, they have the king of clubs but not the ace. Um, so I think I'm going to play, I guess I'll play low. Hey Vic, this is the semi-final against Vassen. Second ball with 14 imps up. Ooh. Well, this defence is very active, and to be honest, I don't mind that. Jack. So I've made one trick. I've got one, two, three more tricks, four, five. I've got five more tricks. So this just gets me my seventh trick, doesn't it? Uh, so this probably means that the Queen of Diamonds is offside now. So we can win this. How... Good, do I trust my card reading here? Let's let's trust it quite well. Let's play a club to the jack. Okay. Play a dime to the king. Ace, throwing a club. Throwing a club. Diamond. Uh, and now if I exit in hearts, East has to win and play a diamond back. So we can pitch... How many times have they thrown here? Oh, I haven't been watching. I think I can do this, and I think we have to exit with a diamond here. Yeah, so that gains me a, that gains me another trick there. 
<laughs> hey Brad, hey PJ. That was quite nice. A little uh, little end play on board one to make an extra trick. I could have always played a club to the nine, but that's not guaranteed. Imping in, indeed. I like that. That was quite nice. That was just counting. I think there's a... It's just a, in terms of how the bots defend. East wouldn't clear their hearts, which means they don't have the ace of clubs. If East has an ace, they would have cleared their heart suit. They would have played ace of hearts, queen of hearts, thinking they're going to get back in with their ace. So when they don't do that, it means they don't have a definite entry, and they're just trying to set up their partner suit instead. Um... So 5, and 11, 12, 13 high card points. We're just going to over overcall a spade. Uh, pass, so don't have a bid. All right, I'm defending five clubs and partners on lead, so please lead a spade. Oh, come off it! Look at dummy! Why would you not lead a spade? So annoying. Have they got five spades, do you think? So West has a singleton heart because with the two hearts, they would have bid four hearts. A partner hopefully has queen to four hearts here. So I think what I'm going to try and do is not give away Extra tricks. Um. Not a singleton diamond. Well, I'll try the queen. Partner of six spades. There we go. I mean, there was a reason for them not leading it. Why would you put the queen in? <laughs> oh my god why would you put the queen up it doesn't matter they had the ten of diamonds so they'd already they'd already buy that bot yeah they'd already found a lead to cost the contract awful I could take, I mean, what do I have to do? Take the SLM to trick one if they know they're going to defend like that? Six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven. So they've always got eleven on the lead, I think. They just lose two diamonds on the lead. Eventually. Yeah, all right. That might be a couple of imps out. <laughs> uh, we have 18, so we're going to open a heart. Uh, an invite in clubs. So I guess we just bid 3N then. We've got an 18 count. Partner's got 10. Um, Yeah, I think three spades is fine. I think you don't want it. Basically, bidding four spades of those colours just says double as when you haven't got a fit. Is three clubs game forcing? Yeah, so in a game forcing situation, if they don't have a fit, bidding four spades just says go for 800 when they haven't got a fit. So I don't mind it. You've got no shortage, no roughing value, no source of tricks. Um, but I, if you bid three spades, I might have a hand that needs to bid four spades, and you don't, you're not giving us that opportunity. You should definitely be bidding some number of spades. All right, so we're in 3N. Are we just going to take a double club finesse? Probably. Uh, 
All right, so they've they've should probably have tried the ten of spades. I guess we will just play another spade. Well, there's the jack, so we can play another spade. All right. And we claim, so we've missed six. Partner's major suit cards are very good. Like, partner's got no wasted values in diamonds, and he's got the jack-10 niner clubs, which are also very big. We've missed six clubs there. Six clubs is a very good spot, I think. Five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve. You just got twelve tricks as long as you pick the clubs up. So tick both the stand's about seventy-five percent, I think. And six clubs is better than six M because if both clubs are wrong, you're only getting one off instead of many off. Uh so that's potentially uh I mean I wonder what four N is for me. I think four N for me is key card in clubs. I've only got two low, so I don't think that's right. But yeah. All right, so we've got woo, quite a lot. So I'm going to bid two hearts, and if they bid up to four spades, I probably have to try five diamonds. There's no way this gets passed out. They've, I'm missing. I only got one spade. And I'll bid three diamonds. Oh, partner's forcing with diamonds, so we'll just bid five diamonds, do we? What's four clubs? Cubid. Yeah, go and do that. All right, I'm just going to be five diamonds then. Partner could have ace to five diamonds and a stiff heart, in which case we're making six diamonds. There's a possibility. Well, all right. Well, he's got the ace of spades, which is a good card. So, um, hmm. They're stopping me roughing hearts. So it needs to be about me not losing too many heart tricks. Uh, so we can either rough a heart or we play a heart to the jack. So we will... They're just leading for a four card diamond suit. So is, this is where we're just going to do some maths here. Heart and a heart buff works when... I think a heart and a heart buff is better because it works on all three three splits. It works whenever someone's got on a double ton. Because we've got the jack and ten. If we didn't have the ten of hearts, but we had the nine, it might be better to play like a heart to the nine or something. But mm. I think a heart and a heart buff is just strictly better. We lose when someone's got king-queen to four hearts only. Um, but if East has king-queen to four, they might insert... So we will try. We'll play a heart, and I think we're losing when West has the king, queen to four. All right, so play ace. We'll play a small heart. And does someone play an honor? Nope. East has played eight high, low in hearts. All right. I'll be annoyed if East has both heart on us because they, they've made a very good duck. All right, so West had them. I don't, West has made a good lead. They've stopped me roughing two hearts, and I cannot make it from that point. So I'm just going to concede a heart and uh, claim the rest. That is a good lead. Well done, sir. If you look at the north south hands, cause you, you kind of want to be in that. They can't really force you to trick one. If they need a spade. Pretty good. You just play a heart, rough a heart, club to the ace, rough a heart, play a diamond, and then hope your hand's good. Maybe. I mean, it's not a great. I mean, it's not great, but even when they they led their best lead, I still had play. Um, but yeah, thankfully there isn't a line to make it. So um, nine, twelve. I think I only lose when he's not in game. But if he's not in game, at least he's not. He's only making like one thirty. A bit of diamond. And I haven't really got a bid now, I think. I think if he passes, I can't really come back in because I've only got a stiff heart. All right, why pass? Um...
I don't like any lead here. I guess I have to lead a diamond. Partners like to have four or five hearts here. Partners almost certainly got, like, I think Partners probably got five hearts here because um, East didn't open two hearts. So we've uh, we've dropped a trick at trick one, but I don't, don't know what else to lead. Oh, no, Partners got Queen of Diamonds. Good on your partner. Queen. Ace. Uh, yeah, we play, we want a diamond back. I think it's clear I've got the king of diamonds, so. And I'm playing the nine, because if I ever win a third diamond, I want to be winning it, not my partner, because I want to be playing this last spade. Um. Play the king of diamonds there, because partner knows the count of my diamond suit. The Clara doesn't. Um, well, I need to play the jack, 10, to, to not confuse partner here. All right, and then they're going to exit, and partner's going to win. Has partner got a heart trick left? I think they, they must have a heart left. They don't have anything else. Must be a heart here. Okay. Flying with ace of hearts is a bit exuberant. Uh, so it's a contract we beat. Um, the lead didn't cost, thankfully. We will take that. Um, we have 15 high card points. I'm going to open, treat this as a strong no trump. I've got 15 and a 6 card suit. I think that's fine. I don't have a stamen. I don't have a 4 card major. And win 3 and Absolutely fine. Not, not necessarily a... All right, win three and and we've got six diamonds, three hearts. Is nine ten. We've got eleven tricks here, unless the jack of hearts falls. So we're probably just going to knock out the ace of spades and then try for some sort of squeeze in spades and hearts. The ten. All right, we play a spade to the queen. We want them to take this, really, because we want to be squeezing them. So they return a diamond or a club. Let's just count our tricks. I think we've got a squeeze on here in spades and hearts. If someone's got four and both majors. Uh, or jack 10, jack 10x. It's just a positional squeeze. Uh, if West has jack 10 tight left, or either of them have four and four hearts, I think there's a squeeze here, so we're, we're, that's what we're going to play for. We're going to win this. We're going to lay down the king of spades. Uh, you are probably right, Vic. Yeah, lead the king of spades if you want them to win the spade. That is correct. Yeah, so I know we've got a beer card here, but we're not making the last trick unless the squeeze works. And if the squeeze works, the seven of diamonds is the beer, is the squeeze card. So we're just missing. Um, I haven't really been watching the spades, but the jack of spades hasn't come down. So we're just going to hope the hearts come in now. There we go. They come in. Um, was East, was West squeezed? Yeah, I mean, West is, oh, the Jack of Hearts is falling. Uh, for it to be a double squeeze around clubs, you need an entry in clubs, don't you? Once they knock out your ace of clubs, you can't have a double squeeze around clubs. And you'd need the squeeze card to be in the north hand, wouldn't you? Unless it's non simultaneous. Yeah, I'm, I mean, if I said four hearts as well, I've got them in a squeeze, so I think it was fine. 
Uh, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 17. Uh, this is a bit too good to open a no trump, I think. My my red suits are pretty good. I'm going to open a heart and over a spade. I might, I might just be 2N. I'll upgrade it. Simple raise. So count my losers. I've got 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6. Uh, I've got a 17 count and partner's got... Yeah, I'm just going to be full of hearts. I think for a double squeeze to work, you need an entry in the double suit, don't you? You'd need my hand to keep ace of clubs, and you need both major suit sets in the north end, in which case you need the squeeze card to be in the north end. Um, unless it's non-simultaneous, in which case you squeeze one person in spades and clubs, and then you cash four hearts, apologies, in hearts and clubs, and then you try and cash three hearts, squeeze someone in spades and clubs. So yeah. Um, all right. So yeah, I think you're right. I mean, there might be because I could see another squeeze. I wasn't going to play for some weird esoteric double squeeze around clubs, especially when you're missing nine of them to start. There's a lot of counting to do in that case. Um, so I have only got one entry to the north hand. So what I need to do is play hearts in a way that I only need one lead from the north hand. Um, but I, it looks like I'm going off here. Uh, so I play the ace. What I need to do is play a heart for them to play a heart back or something. Jack wins. That's bad. Uh, because, yeah, and then they're going to switch to a club. Oh dear, oh dear, oh dear. Yeah, so we're going two off here. We're going to lose a spade as well. So the correct solution was to pass two hearts. So we'll give them a spade as well, so that's pretty bad. I mean, I definitely think you're worth at least an invite, and that's um, because you're worth at least an invite, I think. Maybe you shouldn't. Maybe you should just decide this is... Queen Jack of Clubs are not pulling their weight, I guess. That might be a reason to pass, but maybe that's just being results -y. I think you should invite, and partner would reject it, and you'd be in three hearts, one off, because hearts don't break. But if you can avoid two heart losers, you're going to make nine tricks most of the time. Right. Fourteen we've got with six spades. So we're going to have a call a spade. I generally don't think I'm doing that well so far. Um, potentially board two was annoying. Three could be in slam. Uh, four he might not be in game. Seven he might not be in game. But I definitely made an over trick on board one, so I think <laughs> it's a one imp. So my lead could have evaporated by now. I don't know. I don't necessarily think I've got clear mistakes, but potentially just losing positions. That's a good uh, good support in spades. I've got six. I think I just need to bid four spades. I've got a really bad number of hearts. So my partner might be short in hearts. You never know. All right. So we're going to lose a heart and two diamonds. So this, is, this seems fine. It, we can actually avoid losing a heart by winning the first heart, can't we? We win the first heart and then hope that East follows to the first spade. So this is fine. And then we'll unblock the spades in case we need communications. Um, it's always worth whenever you're just following suit. In this particular case, there's no need to keep 10 and 9 of spades in the north end. Um, because you've got the 3 of spades, the 4 of spades is an entry, but it gives, you, it gives you fluidity in the spade suit. We can now cash 4 clubs throwing a heart and then concede 2 diamonds. So we're going to make 11. But it just gets into good practice unblocking, unblocking as a matter of courtesy. All right, it's gone pass pass to me. I've got fourteen points. In theory, I could have upgrade this to a no trump. I'm not going to. It's four triple three, and my four card suit's really bad. Other than the ace, like my pips aren't working together necessarily. The nine clubs is okay, um, but there's no reason to upgrade this. So I'm just going to open one um, club, which is the. Bid on the hand, I think. 
Good supporting heart, so I'll pass. Pass. Partner hasn't got four spades. If they do, they haven't got a good hand because they could have come in over a heart with a double. So if partner's got four spades, they've got a really bad hand. Um, all right. Um, because I can stop them getting to dummy, I've got the ace over the king, the ace over the king, and the ace over the king. Uh, I think it's, it, it's, it doesn't hurt to play ace of clubs here, does it? In case partner's singleton. Let's play the ace. Yeah, partner singleton, so we can give them a club buffer. Uh, on the basis that I know they can't get to dummy. If they play low, I'm going to play low. Yeah, I'm going to play low. I can't afford the king of spades to be an entry. All right, so West has ace, king, jack to... You get to rough a diamond here, and I rough this, they have rough, but they've probably got the jack of spades because they won the first spade ridiculously high with the queen, didn't they? So they've probably got the jack of spades there. Oh, it must have gone. I must have miscounted. Oh, yeah, Queen Jack Doubleton, right? Okay. All right. If I opened one no chump, we would have played in two spades, which probably makes. Does it? Yeah, it almost certainly makes, isn't it? You lose a spade, two hearts, one diamond. Yeah. All right, so that's probably a losing position. That's probably five imps out there. Uh, we have 16, so we're going to open a no chump. And we're in three and that's fine. All right, we've got three, eight, hopefully, nine, ten. We've got ten tricks. The hearts are wide open, so we're just going to cash our ten tricks and hope that the queen of diamonds falls. So what we're going to do is cash five clubs first. Then three spades, and then see. We'll see what they've led from. I mean, if someone's got five hearts, we can't afford to lose the lead. If someone's got four hearts, we can't afford to lose the lead, so we can't afford to finesse these diamonds. So we will cash some clubs. Yeah, the clubs are breaking, so we can throw three hearts away. And if the queen of diamonds falls... No one's thrown a diamond away yet, have they? That I've seen. Play the jack. King. All right. And then we're not going to make any more cashed our tricks. So they ducked the jack of diamonds. I don't think there's been much to these hands in the play. There has been in the bidding. Um, board four was interesting, although it can't be made. There was an end play on one, but that was just for an over trick. So there's been no so interesting plays for the contract, necessarily. Uh, we have 11 here. I'm going to open a club, and I think I passed a major suit response and partner. Okay, I'm just going to bid one heart. And then I'm going to pass. They're going to lead a spade, but that's not too bad. I've got king 10 extra spades, in addition to whatever partner has. So this seems fine. If they've led from the Queen of Spades, it's all hunky dory. We might have five clubs, a spade, and a heart. Right. I haven't got set my spade trick up yet, so I can't afford to rise with the ace here, because even if the clubs come in, I've only got five club tricks. So I think what we do is just play low. All right. And do we take a heart finesse?
All right, that, what, a, what a weird switch. So now I don't need the clubs to come in. So I think I'm just going to play the clubs from the top. It probably means West has a ten of diamonds, but oh, the clubs come in as well. So yeah, just what an awful switch. Making nine, there's no way they're not gonna. There's no way they're gonna let me. Oh, do you think West was scared of the bath coup? Yeah, they can cash roll diamonds in the ace of spades, in two spades. They can keep it to seven. But with the king of hearts on side and clubs 3-3, three, three, I'm always making that. Right, we have um, 14 high card points. We're so 6-4 in the red suits. Um, we don't really have a double. We just have to bid two diamonds here. And if they bid two spades, it goes past past to me. I might double, which should show four hearts. All right, we're in two diamonds. That has got quite a bit. They'd seen my overcalls before. They might have tried to end in real life if my uh, one, two, three, four, five, six, ten. We've got a ten count in a spade stop. I think you, you know. I would have liked to see two n. You're vulnerable. I think we've missed game here, have we? Three n's good by north. Right, that we win that. I think we're just gonna let's have a quick count of the points. Um, I think because the, my hand's good, I don't need to worry about any of the winners in the north hand. I can just play a club to the ace and then try a diamond. See what to do. All right, okay. I'm just making the rest, making eleven. Yeah, I mean three hand makes, isn't it? You're too good to pass to the north hand. You've passed. You are virtually a maximum passed hand. And you've got Queen Jack to four in their suit. You've got to stop. That's just... Just poor. It just is. It is poor. My guess is that Raston will be in the same spot. I don't think you've got any other bid other than to ever call two diamonds with the hand you've got. Oh dear. Alright, so 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12. We've got 12. We're going to open one heart. I don't necessarily think I'm doing very well this side. I don't necessarily have that many outright plus positions. Uh, partner bids a spade. We're going to bid two diamonds. Partner bids two spades. Uh, so I pass. What's one heart, two spades? That's strong, isn't it? So I'm just going to pass. All right, so we're in the right spot. If they don't find a diamond switch trick two, I get my diamond from the north underway. If they do, I need to start attacking these clubs, maybe. Ooh. So what I need, so basically, because I switch the jack, I could put the queen on it, encourage them to take the ace. But what I'm going to do is play low. I really want to win this club with the king. And if he thinks West has Jack 10xx or something. So we'll play low. Alright. Can he streak that for Singleton? Wow, they've let me get the diamond away. That's pretty nice, isn't it? And we play a spade. I probably should have played the spade before the uh, Queen of Hearts. But now we rough for diamond. And then we either concede a spade or we don't. So are we conceding a spade? Nope. Making 11. I can't bid that, can I? The jack of club switch is so good for us. Like, if they just play diamonds back, they make a heart, a diamond, and a club. And we have to play, and we have to burn clubs ourselves. Better bridge technique to not concede a spade. Thanks, Brad. They are 
useful tips. Have you ever seen meta jokes? That's like a meta joke, that is. I mean, should we bid it is what we should say. Should we bid it? Or should we be in it? You don't really... I mean, if you're in it, the fact that it has plays, and I don't have either red suit ace, the fact I've got, the, you know, more than half my values are in my partner's black suits is just luck, I think. But that meta jokes are things that are technically true, and they're like, what's white and can't climb trees? A fridge. Or uh, what's red round and not there? No tomatoes. So they're meta jokes. So Brad's, Brad's tip is technically true, but in the context is just fatuous. Why did the girl fall off the swings? She had no arms. You know, just, just daft stuff. So yeah, this doesn't look good. I mean, the last three boards is we made enough tricks for game, made enough tricks for game, made enough tricks for game. So not the best so far. We're going to open this a no chump. Oh, hang on. Yeah, this is 14, so it can open a no chump. On 13, I rebid a no chump. Probably not. But the fact that it shows two spades is the issue, isn't it? Uh, I don't have a four card major. All right, we're in three N. This is not a good spot. Oh dear, this is not a good spot at all. So I need spades to be breaking. I need diamonds to be breaking. One, two, three, four. Nine. I need either, I need diamonds to come in basically, so I need diamonds to be 3-3 three, three. and spades not to be 5-2, so if spades are 4-3 and diamonds are 3-3 three, three, I can make this. And even if I show this as a weak now jump, my partner still invites and I accept, so we play low. I guess we win that and we just play a low diamond. You're flying with a queen. I don't think I can ever read to duck that a trick one. Can I? They haven't bid them. It probably means diamonds aren't breaking of spades a six one. I don't, I mean, ducking the spade a trick one might be right. All right. Hmm. Well, I'm a faffing. I've just got the rest now, haven't I? Yeah, I was not counting my tricks. Uh, if yeah, if, yeah, I realised that. Vic. If West had bid, I might have got that right. Like, if I open a diamond, West might bid two spades, and if I get to three n, I think I might be able to read the spade situation. The other, the other thing you do, the Queen of Hearts is an entry, isn't it? So you can actually make, you might be able to make it still if you play, after winning the King of Spades as it went, play Ace King and another Diamond. And East wins but doesn't have a spade left. And so plays a, a club, you win, you clear the Diamonds and you get in with the Queen of Hearts, do you not? I think they can block you. They might, you might lose fluidity in entries. But clubs are 3-3, three, three, so 
if they return one two no i think i think they block you by rising with the king of hearts and and playing a third club kills your entries doesn't it to untangle the heart tricks let's just double check whether we can make that yeah you can You are right, PJ. I think you've got to test diamonds, haven't you? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Yeah, you just you don't even need the diamonds, do you? You can just play. Win the King of Space player, club to the ace, and then a heart to the queen, and then you can untangle your tricks. All right, I saw one line went with it, and that was wrong. Here I've got 11. I'm just going to pass this. This is not a good 11, and we're vulnerable. All right, we're defending two diamonds. Uh, Dummy only had... Seven, eleven, eighteen. Partner's got eleven, exactly. I think it's gonna eleven, 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 and then East has got seven, so partner's got eleven. Which is good. So I think I win the king, and I think I just play a heart. Uh what I want is a heart back. Before uh West has a chance to throw a heart away on the third spade or something. Hmm. Diamond or low diamond, that's fine. I might make the king now. They're missing the jack. Yeah, they're missing the jack. Yeah. That's annoying. The partner's got ace of hearts, jack of diamonds, that's five. They've got six on points. They've got ace queen of clubs, this partner. They're going to rough a heart in the, the dummy, aren't they? So maybe I'll pitch a heart here. I don't think it matters. Pitch a heart. All right. Yeah. And they've got a heart left? You've got four hearts. No, we've got another diamonds. Hmm, what can we make? We can definitely make a part score in clubs. Uh, the ace of spades is on side for us. It's not a comfortable spot. Hearts are not that good. Clubs of four one, yeah. I don't know if I've won this. I really don't. I don't think. I don't feel I've done very well at all. I don't think I've got many good positions there. So we will see. Uh, I've got thirteen, so we're going to overcall a heart. Yeah, I think you're right. Two clubs will be a struggle. Two hearts and partner pass. Um, I mean, West has a heart stop here, so I don't really want to go too far. I've got a pretty bad 13 count. Uh, my guess is the hearts might be 4-0 here. So we can play low as ace. Yeah, and they switch to a diamond. This probably means West has a, the, one of the ace or king of diamonds here. Yeah. Uh, so I'm going to lose a spade and I might lose a heart. So it looks like I'm going to make 8 or 9. Do I? Are the hearts 4 0? Right, what can I do to stop that? Prediction lose by 10. I will take that.
My nine of clubs is a winner, isn't it? But I can just... I've got to play a spade. And then... I mean, there is an end play if, uh, if West has the Ace of Spades, but they don't. Win. Yeah. Oh, they did have the Ace of Spades. I might have been able to wangle something there. Yeah. We had to duck when I played a spade to the Queen. All right. Who knows? Right, we win by four. It did not feel like a win, but I guess he's playing the same boards, and I think you've always got to bear that in mind, that when you when the boards are going bad for you, the bots are doing exactly the same to him. If you're bidding the same, they're doing the same thing. So we're going to have a look at the few swings. It is a really flat set, not what he wanted. So I'm going to pop that in the chat in a second. It was a really flat set, I think. It like it didn't feel like I'd done very well, but I didn't feel like I'd necessarily lost forty imps or anything. So, uh, who will I beat in the finals? It looks like um, I'm playing J Wolf. I'll show you the. While we're here, I'll show you the um, thing. So this is not completely up to date because of Reno. Uh, Jay Wolf beat Curling Guy. And Jay Wolf is 35 ups, imps up against McNow in their semi-final. Uh, I played Rassen and I've just beat Rassen by a total of 18. It's my lowest victory so far in the event. And that was over 30 two boards as well and then there was some loser stuff going on so i've i i've going to play probably j wolf i j wolf and then i've got a long wait for my next match so if i do win that let's have a quick look at the swings board four uh if we go to other view board four was uh rassen other tables Rassen played in four hearts. The so three diamond shows, three spade shows diamond support. And yet Rassen decided to elect to play in four hearts. I think if partners got diamond support, they've got four. I don't think they would show three card support here. So if partners got four card diamond support, you never want to play in four hearts, do you? Obviously, if hearts are favourable for you in four hearts, I'm making five diamonds. So, like, you're not gaining on me by ever playing in four hearts here. Um... And then that just went uh, that just went three off, so that was that was there. Board five, he doubled. I considered doubling, I was just a bit minimum, and I didn't really want to defend two deck two hearts doubled, which is the likely spot here. Like partner partner's got to have heart length, so doubling just says with playing two hearts doubled if you've got hearts. Um and thankfully partner's hearts are good enough that he was able to beat it. Um so we gained two imps on me there. Board eight. I big game. He did not. Yeah, I just decided with whenever you've, whenever you've got a six four fit, it's not guaranteed you got six four. But as soon as you've got a nine or a ten card fit, it's just so much better. Um, and partner puts down two bullets, which is un, un, unexpected. But they could have a diamond chick and the jack of clubs or something. He beat me on this board. He. Opened a diamond, and rather than defending two hearts, he got to play in three diamonds making. So yeah, can't do much about that. Although I thought I was going to lose that board by him opening an O chump and playing two spades, so I was expecting to lose that board anyway. And after that, it was just uh, he made an extra trick here. Wow! How'd you make an extra? I already thought they, they led through against me. How'd you make an extra trick here? King of diamond switch, same, heart, same, same. 
that's greedy. That's really greedy because that's super greedy, isn't it? Because if they can now go diamond, diamond, diamond. And then if the clubs, I mean, if the hearts come in, but the clubs are, aren't 3-3, three, three, they can play a club at some point and then you can't untangle the hearts. That's really greedy, but it worked because they played a heart back. All right. And then I made an extra trick here. Ten of spades, spade, spade, king, ace, king. Yeah, so for some reason, they flew with the queen of diamonds against me when I crossed the dummy. So that was unlucky for him on the box part. But that is one of the flattest sets of bridge. I think Rassen, when I often when I play Rassen, I get a lot of flat bridge because he's very consistent, very steady. He doesn't do weird things, so... Um, yeah, so that was my table. That was four imps to me. And the two boards I gained on were board four, where it was a good technical hand that you can't make five diamonds, but a good technical hand for how to play the hearts. And board eight was me bidding game, and, and luckily partner had a good hand. So, uh, What was the first set result? I won by 14, book. Um, first set was, I'll just show you quickly. It is there. So I bid a grand on board two, which which was my only bad board. I actually thought I, I, I felt much better about the first set. I was making extra tricks. I was bidding good. I bid this six clubs here. I felt much better about board uh, this set. Every time where we couldn't really make many tricks, I stayed low. So I was much, ha much, much happier with my first set of boards than my second set. So. Anyway, that is the Rattlestake Knockout semi-finals. I'm through to the final of the Undefeated People. I will be playing probably IJ Wolf, but maybe even McNow. And that will be the next video in this series of videos. And if I win that, I will be effectively one or two matches away from winning the whole thing. So we will see how that goes, and I will look forward to seeing you soon. Farewell.